before the first pitch will be thrown out on Friday, the first 15,000 fans will be getting this bobblehead of Chris and his furry pals Ainsley and Shay. What are your thoughts on this? How do you feel that they not only captured you, but your dogs? Yeah, I love it just because my dogs are there. <laughs> I don't care about me at all. I love my dogs, so I'm happy with them. Got him. Great run on that two-seam fastball. That's seven strikeouts now for Chris Bassett. Bassett didn't come into the major leagues as a starting pitcher. He was a reliever at the University of Akron, where he had impressive outings from the bullpen. Got him. The sweeper. In just this season as a starter with the Jays, the 35-year-old shut down the Phillies' offense and ended their home winning streak at 11 games. How does your mindset change from being a reliever to a starter? Yeah, I would say you have to understand how to, how to manipulate a lineup uh, three or four times through. You have to understand how to like control your energy for 100 pitches rather than, say, 10 or 15 pitches. Um, but yeah, overall, I would just say it's, it's, it's understanding how to face lineups multiple times in a row. Are you saying anything to yourself when you're going to start a game, when you're going to the mound, or anything that you repeat? I mean, my biggest thing always, and I've, I've done a pretty bad job of it this year, honestly, but um, it is just don't beat yourself. Um, don't walk guys. If I give up hits and they score runs, so be it. But, yeah, it ke keeps me up at night when I walk a guy and he scores. I mean, I, I just think, I mean, we're blessed here for, to have a great defense, and for me to walk guys is, is unacceptable, in my opinion always his harshest critic, but he's giving fans at least 10,000 reasons to smile. Bassett and his wife will once again donate $10,000 U.S. to the Jays Care Foundation for every time the Jays win a game in which he pitches. My wife and I obviously wanted to impact the community, especially with kids, having two kids, and um, yeah, I would say that's just kind of what we've we've set out to do. One thing many fans don't know about the hound on the mound is that he also has some pretty decent hoop skills. Is this something that you make sure you bring up every day to your teammates? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was all state in basketball, and uh, there, there's a um, there's a couple guys on our team that think they can play with me. Um, that's a lie. <laughs> that's a lie. Have you guys ever actually played a little pickup ball? No, no, no. We we always joke around and say. If we, if we finish the year how we want to finish the year, um, we're going to find a basketball court and settle it. So um, it will, it'll, it'll end very ugly for a lot of guys, especially uh, our starter tonight, Kevin Gosman. I'll say that. Are you going to dunk on him? I will give him about eight points to 11 and beat him. For City News, I'm Lindsay Dunn.